take off words, okay? My video speed is on. Because I need to use the camera control, so I'm flying in GPS position hold mode. Just flying a little bit higher. Okay, that's good. Now I have camera controls. Go higher a little bit. And try to read some signs. for zoom in can read the number clearly right zoom out read the sign Here. We have a little bit of uh, interference with the If I move the camera, we never see the landing skids, right? Anybody in the jungle? That's pretty nice zoom, right? Mm. Mm -hmm. I'm blinking, I don't know why. That's my radio interference to this 5.8 GHZ. You mean get our faces? Mm. Okay, let me see. I put the quad at this side then. And shoot our faces. Put in the mode, FPV mode, zoom in, there, you can see on the screen, it's a little flickery flickery because of the radio being too close. Shoot this car. But I can see clearly the numbers and everything. Look, we can read those boards from this far, right? Very clearly. Okay.
manual mode is where you can actually fly really fast for chasing and it still feels like in GPS mode because once you leave the six it's really really stable at its point but when you move no matter how much angle the camera stabilizes really nice for chasing this is your mode Flight performance wise, I'm really, really satisfied. It offers plenty of speed and control, superb control actually on uh, uh, manual mode even. So basically when I take off in manual mode, it almost feels like I'm taking off GPS position hold mode. You can always take off in GPS position hold mode. So in GPS position hold mode, it's at, at the moment it's flying very slow because the uh, angle of attack for forward flight is set very low. But you can always use your Android phone GCS and set the parameters instantly to a different angle of attacks and your quadcopter will fly a little faster and offer you more uh, cruise speed in GPS position hold mode as well. Right now it's set for steady and normal, I mean steady and stable flight so that you can do, uh, you can control the cameras, uh, tilt angle and actually fly FPV. Now when you set it to uh, camera control, gimbal control mode, uh, it becomes a little trickier to control when camera is extremely zoomed in, but uh, setting up some dual rates and uh, endpoints today helped a lot. And today the camera is not moving up and down that much as it was moving before. Uh, the thing is, when the camera zooms in a lot, it has its own stabilization. I have checked on the ground that when camera zooms in, the gimbal actually stays at its position. It does not tilt down. It's the camera stabilization somehow which is tilting downwards and after an angle it will not tilt anymore it will stop there but again when it's extremely zoomed in it becomes very twitchy to control so I set the endpoints and expo on the radio and it helped a little bit today it did help so I have to set more endpoints um, and maybe expos to better control the camera on zoom but uh, honestly speaking, if you want, if I want to get a shot of a car number plate or license or registration plate, or I want to take a look at something, I want to take a look at the window. It's it's actually enough for me, enough time or enough control for me to get the right shot that I want to do. Now I feel there was a bit of jello as well, which we can remove later uh, by working on it. But it's not for aerial filming, it's for aerial surveillance. So we don't care much about Jello at the moment here. Enjoy. And last thing, if you want to see how the parachute works, well, I'm not going to test the parachute because uh, we spoke to ZeroTech as well. And they said parachute is for emergency users to save your equipment, not to test and land safe safely. So basically, when the parachute opens in emergency, there are chances you will break your landing gear or damage something if it lands 
wrong on the trees or like lands on a stone or something so we don't want to test the uh, parachute at the moment we will keep the parachute for emergency purposes only enjoy and let's test the big 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 one Thank you. 